Yes. Uh, đi chuyển đi chuyển bằng kiểu thế. Where from here, Minis? Bao giờ cả cả nhiều khi đó, bao giờ? Ngờ, đây. Uh, I need to move my student to sit here yes. and talk. Yeah. Yes, no problem. Perfect. Good. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> Did you have dinner, Dick? Sorry. Did you have? Yeah. Did you have dinner? Okay. Can you hear us? Se escucha interferencia. <coughs> ok, yo sí te digo, si ¿sí te escucho bien, Monse. Sí, bueno, yo le escucho bastante. Ok. Ok, bueno, yo le escucho, pero no lo veo. Se queda como muy trabajo. Como corto, ¿verdad? Ajá, se trae en su parte. Hello, can um, hello, can you hear me? Yes, of course. Yes, yes. Uh, do, do, here is Carla. <laughs> Carla is what, another uh, of my students. Carla is the phone number you see there, 9800141107. That is Carla. That is the number. <laughs> <laughs> like the, yeah. the, behind the, behind the number call, is number. Carla. I can call okay. he yeah carla is teacher duong duong this is carla okay and here yeah. we are with her students uh, how many students i have uh, four students yeah but if you want one we can start no problem okay yeah yeah yes <clears throat> One more. Yes. Yeah. Hello, Monster. Mon Monster, right? Monster, yes. Hello, Monster. Monster. <laughs> yeah, hello, Monster. And yeah. hello, Carla. 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 Uh, where is Carla? Uh, Carla. Uh, that uh, that Carla. be the number, number, right? Exactly. Ah, exactly. uh, yeah. Uh, Carla is a, a girl or a boy? A girl. It's a girl. Ah, yeah, a girl. Okay. It's a girl. Yes. Come, come. Make it show up. We will wait some students and we start later, right? Very good. Yes. 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 It's two more. So let, let's wait. I don't know. One yes. or two minutes. Yes. Okay. okay. Yeah. It's okay. Hello, Mick. Hello, how are you? Uh, I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm fine. Good, great. Let's say, Monse, please say hello, Monse. <laughs> Carla, say hello, Carla. Do you remember? Hello. Me? <laughs> yes, of course, yes. One of the best students from Teacher Dong. Where is the video? Where is the video? Where is the video of Kala? Kala, hello, Kala. Hello, Kala, she said. Hello. Video, my dear. Uh, 
So, okay, Tom, if you agree, we can start on if you want to. Yeah? Yes. Okay, let, let's start with, with Monse. Um, Monse, um, ¿puedes poner tu presentación, Monse? Ah, ok, déjame ver. Sí. Ya. Yeah. Ok. Mm -hmm. Monse is going, is going to start to present, ok? To, to do her presentation. Um, Mick? Yes? Uh, do you allow me to share the screen? Yes, yes. No, no, uh, no, 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 yes, you can. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes, I want to share some pictures about something. Very that, good, yes. Yeah, that student will talk. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, where are they? Okay, wait a minute. Where is that? Uh, do you have any question with me to me? Yes, see. Deja, Monse, yo lo comparto, si quieres, y ya tú lo vas pensando, ¿sí? Okay. Okay. Okay, this is what, what Monse prepared, okay, for everybody. Monse is going to speak about typical Mexican food. Okay. Okay, Monse, please start. Monse, empieza, por favor. Okay. Um, hello, yeah. my teacher. I am Monse Rodriguez. Uh, I am um, Yes. And uh, typical Mexican food. And number one, have two pozole. And the pozole consists of the cooking of the tawachinho. Say it again? Yes. A type of light thing, and that's a deep dish, must be cooked in two different dishes for several hours. Pozole is a deep type of corn, a culture of corn. In Mexico, it's. From the cold coast to the highlands and from border to border. It has its origin in the ground of bottom. And that the indigenous states of it? Indigenous, yes. Indigenous people now not they mixing corn water. Yes, yes, this is a typical dish in Mexico. Usually we eat this in celebrations. For example, or Independence Day, we eat pozole. Okay. Monse, please, mole. In number two, mole. The true original of mole is found in Hispanic. Juntos with the indigenous people mixing prayer, chill the prayer with empty. Holy grass and tomato to create a sauce. A sauce. They call it mulli. This was normally a component with the king meat. It's mulli. Also. Alto, uh huh. Alto, the dish or albadillo meat. And last of all, is ceremonial as an offering. Offering, uh huh. Okay, good. Good. In Mexico, we prepare it on any occasion, on holidays, some special celebrations, or every day. Exactly. This is like a kind of a sauce, a spicy sauce. 
that is also eaten, eaten on special days and special celebrations. The flavor is very spicy and the flavor is very hot. Usually we eat mole with rice. It's very typical, it's very typical to eat mole and white rice. And look here, we also can also eat tortillas, tortillas with mole and rice, okay? Very good. Enchiladas. And number three, enchiladas. They are derived from the tortilla that originates the food in Colombia. Civilizations. Civilization of North America. Person or experience. Enchiladas were now in independent. Independent? Independent. Okay. When? When Miguel Hidalgo, Vicente Guerrero, and José María Morelos surveyed South Mexican territory. The enchiladas is a dish that in Mexico is not the food corn tortilla, but baked, baked in a specific sauce, using chili in its preparation. Perfect, exactly. This is a traditional and historical dish in Mexico. These people, Miguel Hidalgo, Vicente Guerrero, and Jose Maria Morelos, they are Mexican heroes for Mexican independence. So to celebrate that they achieved Mexican independence, Mexican people designed and made this traditional dish for them, okay? And it's called enchiladas, okay? Good, Monse. Chiles? Uh, chiles and nogada. There are different versions of the origin of chiles and nogada. The most popular say that this dish was created by the Augustinian. Augustinian known of the Santa Monica Women in Puebla. To celebrate the independence of Mexico. Something at, at advantage of seasonal products, fruit and the pomegranate. Pomegranate and the walnut of Castilla. Good. This Known to try a fruit that carries the national color, green, white, and red. Exactly. Basically, this is the most typical and the most traditional food for Independence Day. Why? Because it has the three colors for our flag green, white, and red. And it's really delicious, okay? This chili is not hot, it's not spicy. So you can eat it and you won't get um, a stomach ache or stuff like that, okay? Let's continue. This one's a cochinita. Cochinita pibir. The origin of this delicacy. 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 back to the Hispanic time. In the state of Yucatan. When is, when it was, this marriage to the prepare, it has an offering. For important celebration, may only for the day of the big note. As final, Big Sun. The name of this dish derives is derives. Derives, <laughs> huh? Derives from the Mayan language. Okay. For the ancient people of the Mexican state. Yes. We were a uh, mostly Mayan the teeth or the beer. What is the method of cooking meat? Exactly. This is a, a dish that is from the south of, of the country. This is pork, okay, or something beef with a special condiment. The condiment is called pibil, okay. And this is a um, historic dish from our settlers called the Mayas. Okay. Very good. Okay, that was all about Monse. So maybe the one if maybe your students can, can ask, I don't know, one or two questions to Monse.
cái món này món thứ hai hay món mà cô à, món này nói nè cái món này là cái món này là cái nói trắng cái món thứ hai là cái gì món khác biệt nữa à, mò mò le mò mò le hello món sữa hello yeah hello uh, can you name can 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 you tell me the name of the second food the second mò mò le right As ¿Cómo se llama Monse, el segundo platillo, Monse? El, el mole, ¿no? Exacto. Yeah, yeah, mole, mole. Um, I see the Mexican, uh, Mexican food is very uh, delicious. And, you know, I think it's quite fatty, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. Quite fatty. Exacto. And, and there, is, yeah, there is little... Uh, the trees in your foot. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, it's very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice for festivals. It's very nice. Yeah. Um, uh, Hello, Monsa. Um, Uh, how are you? How are you, Monse? ¿Cómo estás? Fine, thank you. And you? Excuse me, but can you? Repeat. Okay. Okay. Can Can you hear me? Ah, uh, she's talk quite uh, uh, small. So, um, can you answer her question? That how old are you, Monsa? Yeah. Um. Is it um? Uh, sorry. Mr. Mick, uh, is it polite in uh, Mexico to ask about the age? Uh, yes, yes, of course. It's yes. okay? No, no problem, yes, of course. Ah, uh, yeah, no problem, right? No because problem, in yes. Vietnam, yeah, because in Vietnam, asking age, it is the first one that they want to ask because they want to have a nice, you know, talk about the elder. They respect the elder. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah okay. so, okay. Okay, that's it, Monty. Uh, I am 16 years. <laughs> uh, really? What would you like to do in your free time? Um, I want to ask, what are you want to do in your free time? ¿Qué te, qué te gusta hacer en tu tiempo libre, Monse? Uh, um, I like Can you talk again? I cannot hear you. Ah, que, que si te puedes hablar más fuerte, Monse, pues no te pueden escuchar. Uh, okay, one moment, please. Ah, ¿sí se escucha más? Sí. Ah, okay. Mejor, mucho mejor. And repeat me my answer. Ah, yes. ¿Qué edad, qué edad tienes? Uh, I am uh, 16 years. 16, yeah, okay. A uh, teacher, don, here is, here is Carla. Here is my student, Carla. Ah, uh, hello, Mick, and hello, Carla. Hello, Monster. Mm, uh, this is my student, Kimain. Uh, she will talk about um, a very popular food. 
in Vietnam and very, you know, very famous all over the world. Yeah. Okay, now let's uh, see. Give you on. want to talk about food famous in Vietnam, okay? Okay. I will talk about Vietnamese beef noodle. <laughs> the place of origins, uh, ingredients, and how to cook, and finally is raw and meaning. Vietnamese beef noodle is one of the most popular dishes in Vietnam. The origins of Vietnamese beef noodle originates in northern Vietnam in the early 20th century and then became popular in Vietnam and many parts of the world after the Vietnam War. For it's a traditional Vietnamese dish originating from Hanoi and Namting, and it considers one of the one of the typical dishes for Vietnamese cuisine. <laughs> the, the main ingredients of first are rice noodle and bro or as Sultan is called it. With things like beef or chicken, there are also spices such as lemon pepper salt. With chili sauce, the spices are added depending on the user taste. For it's usually used to make breakfast in the morning or to make dinner at night. But in a big city, this can be enjoyed all day. In the southern province of Vietnam and some other regions, for a service with a plate of herb, just as spring onion and coriander leaves, in Greek cilantro is the typical leaf of herb. But in Hanoi, is normal will not have this plate of raw vegetable. How to enjoy? When eating for people often add lemon or kumquat or a little vinegar. In addition, people still often eat food with bean sprout, raw vegetable, and pickled garlic. Go onion. First combination is from many different ingredients, so they provide people with many nutrients such as calcium, mineral, and vitamin, bring high econ economic expenses. For its a dish in the salt position of its meat cuisine, one of the most attractive dishes in the world. Perhaps that's why 
when visiting Vietnam, foreign tourists always eat this special dish. <laughs> I love pho. Okay. Um. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Very good. Okay. Then it's time for Carla to present. Okay. Carita, voy a compartir tu presentación y tú las. Okay. Car Carla is going to speak about uh, Mexican traditions. Okay. Very good. Okay. Wait a minute. There it is, okay. Oh, yes, Carla. Yeah, yeah. Um, Mexican traditions. Day of the dead. The tradition of the day of the dead arises as part of religious syncretis in colonial times in Mexico. The tradition of the celebration to visiting loved ones or have already the part departed in geometries and preparing altars with food, candles, incense, photograph, photographs, and flowers to remember them. Um, Independence Day. It the celebrate celebrate of September 16. 16 in mm. um, every corner of Mexico, it the begins of the night of the 15. 15. 15 when people begin to congregate in the main squares and so lot of fish. City of Town. The culminating point is the way the president or a member of the local government simulates the famous lead the independence, breaks the bell, and helps the national flag, recreating what Father Hidalgo did of the September. 16. 16. 18, 10. 18, 10. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Um, posadas. It is one of the most beautiful traditions in Mexico. It is celebrated from December 16. Six, 16 of age, year on. Until December 24. 24. 24, like many of the tradition, this one also a religious origin. Here is a recreation of the journey that the Virgin Mary and Saint Joseph make in search of refuge in the days before the beat of the chill, Jesus of, on those dates, there are processions in which candles are lit and Christmas songs are sung. The processions ends at the home of one of the participants in which they have a small party with music and dance. Each night, a different host is shows. Very good, okay. Christmas in December 24. 24 in Mexico, there are these different ways to celebrate it. There are some who participate in the last posadas and they meet as a family for Christmas dinner. There are others who attend the tradition rosters, mas and Mindy, midnight. To celebrate the birth of the child Jesus and then have a Christmas dinner as family. One of the elements that is not lacking in Mexico Christmas is the Navity, 
which is a representation of the nativity. There take place fig, fig, figures. <clears throat> figures of the Virgin Mary, San Joseph, and the children of the Christmas tradition are the pastorelas, dramatic, dramatization Delicious. of the shepherds, journey to go to worship this. Very good. That was for for Carla. Okay, so maybe teacher Don, your students can ask a question. Can ask Carla a question, maybe. Hello, Kala. Where's Kala? Kala? <laughs> yeah, hello. Um, in Vietnam, we also celebrate. Hello? Yeah, hello. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Kala? Can you hear me, Kala? Uh, yeah, my student yes. have yeah my student have a question about Christmas Day in Mexico because uh, in Vietnam we also celebrate the Christmas Day. Yeah. También en Vietnam se celebra el día de Navidad. Carla, te voy a preguntar una algo del día de Navidad en México. Ah, uh, hello, uh, Christmas in is how you are. Again, no. Um, okay. Uh, uh, okay. 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 Uh, um, uh, uh, tenamos, bueno, es que no se puede Ah, yes. Uh, I will translate for Carla, okay? Carla says that she usually has a special dinner with her family in her house. Okay. ¿Qué más, Carita? ¿Qué más, qué más, qué más? Um, cenamos, bailamos, y a las dos en punto, pues, pedimos deseos. Good. They, she said that they have dinner, special dinner, they dance, and at midnight, at midnight, they wish the best for everybody. Okay. At midnight? Exactly, at um, midnight, they, yeah. they, they wish so, uh, for the best. Mm, mm. Akala, can I ask you a question? Si Hello, Carla. Hey, um, at your Christmas day, uh, do you often give presents to each other? Ah, sí. Si tu familia dan regalos yeah. en el día de Navidad, Carla. Uh, yes or no? Um, yeah. So, what do you often give to the other? Put the present. Que es un regalo típico en tu familia, Carla. ¿Qué es el um, present? Bueno, es que nos damos hasta uno, pero pues no sé, como una, como chamarras, botellas, o cosas. Ah, yes, clothes, jackets, huh? uh, wine bottles. Yes. Flowers, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Will you give flowers on this occasion? <laughs> flowers, maybe. Flores, Carla. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, okay, okay, yeah, I understand. Yeah, right. <laughs> and uh, three, huh? three talking about onto, onto, onto. Um, okay, so um, something about our country. Uh, 
Do you want to know something about my school? Ah, sí. Hello. Este, Carlita y Monse. Yeah, okay. Si, si, si tienen una pregunta acerca de su escuela. A ver, que inicie Monse. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the only boy will talk something about our school. Yes. Monse has a question about your school, Don, teacher Don. Eh, sobre su Hello. escuela? Ah, uh -huh. yes. Okay. Hello. Uh, ¿De qué parte son? ¿Cómo se diría? Uh, where do you live in Vietnam? I must say, where do you live in Vietnam? Uh, where do you live in Vietnam? Oh, oh yeah. Um, I live in Quang uh, Binh province. In the province of Quang Binh. Okay. Yes. Good. Carlita, a, a question. Okay. Carla, Carla has a question for for your class. Okay. Carla, a ver, dime, dime tu pregunta, Carla, y yo te la tra traduzco. Um. Es sobre la escuela, ¿verdad? Ah, o lo que quieras. Entonces, Um, uh, ¿Cuál es la nombre, el nombre de la escuela? Ah, yes. Uh, Carla wants to know what is this, the school name? What is your school name? Um, my school name uh, Nguyen Chai High School. Nguyen Chai High School. Hey. Es una preparatoria. Yes. yes. Preparatoria. Uh, 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 um, um, The, my school guys is beautiful and with uh, uh, green tea. Um, there we go. Okay. Uh, uh, inside the school guest house, some picture. Do you some picture? Do you some picture about? Um, in, uh, in the picture about um. Um, how you feel my school about uh con này con lấy cũng nghe nhiều em nói Uh, okay. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, he is very shy. Um, okay. Something about uh, my school, and and now we're something about uh, uh, our flag and our na na national flower. Okay. And if you have any question, let interrupt me and ask. Is it right? Very good. Very good. Yes. Van a, van a okay. De su escuela, chicas, y de la tradición de su escuela. Good. Yes. Perfect. Yeah. Don, this yes, is some. Good. Yeah. This is. Yeah. Okay, our next student, new. Yeah. We will talk something. Hello. Hello. Hello, my name is Nyung. I'm sitting here. Uh, I still I study at school, Nguyen Trai High School. Uh, in my free time, uh, I always play sports, listening and cooking. Um, the flag is a typical symbol of the country of Vietnam. Uh, it has quite meaningful color, uh, the red and yellow skin of verbal saying when it comes to Vietnam. Uh, the golden star on the flanks represents the five club in society. Uh, Lotus International uh, Flower of the Vietnamese. It had a very beautiful color. Um, 
khá là cô uh, Incredus the Python uh, Peto and uh, Brands Okay. Okay. One more student talk about uh, traditional clothes in Vietnam. Do you see me in the picture? Yes. Of course, yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Do you see me in the picture? Yes. Ah, uh, that is our. Uh, that is our um, college at school. Uh, on of a square outside in the event. Yes, and you see our traditional clothes. And uh, my student will talk something about um, traditional clothes. Okay. Hablar de ropa tradicional de Vietnam. Hello. How are you? Hello. Hello. How how are you? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm fine, thank you. Um, my name is Khánh Linh. I am Sitin Yeo. I come from Viet. I come from Quảng Bình, Vietnam. From best to prison, outside has been a tradition. Traditional uh, custom which is a typical culture cultural uh, cultural future of Vietnamese woman is particular. Vietnam outside is not only chosen by women to use in, in solemn event, holiday, new year, wedding. But, but as so many women as office, teacher and student job to be couple, custom is school, girl and girl has to wear outside on, fit, on first day of the world. As for everyone, wearing is on fest day. Okay. Outside. <laughs> Um, can you see the picture? Uh, no, yet, no, uh, no yet. There on the screen, there is no picture yet. Uh, the picture is about outside of a um, student. Okay. And uh, very, uh, a white, is it white? It's not colorful. Uh? Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, do you have any question? Maybe this is wrong. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, yes. And now, uh, yeah. uh, do you have any question for them? I uh, guess uh, maybe Adriana. Uh, here we have uh, my, my other student. Her name is Adriana. Uh, Adriana, could you please uh, turn on your camera, please, Adriana? Yeah. Please, 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 camera, Adriana, por favor. So she's okay. Adri Adriana. Okay. One, one of my students. Um, ah, yeah. Wong, this is Adriana. Adriana, this is Wong. Hi. Ah, hello. Ah, uh, Mick. Okay, hello. Can I uh, uh, talk a question? I have a question. Uh, I have to go to, um, do some a uh, uh, little thing now, and uh, you, Mick, you can uh, talk with my student, okay? I will leave the room just about two minutes. Very good. Okay? Yes. Yes. Yeah, okay, okay. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Uh, 
Ok, Adriana, a ver, este, hay una pregunta a Lee. Hello, Lee. Hello, Lee. How are you? How are you? Uh, yes, I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Okay. Adriana, please. Hi, Andrew. Hi. Lo que quieras preguntar, Adriana, lo que sea. What is your age? Sorry? Hi. What is your age? What is today? What, how, what is how old are you? How how old are you, Lee? How old are you? How old? How, how old are you? I don't hear. Listen, how old are you? How old are you? Yes. <laughs> I'm not 16 years old. Very good. Okay, okay, okay. Monse, pregunta, Monse. Eh, how do you say, has probado comida mexicana? Have you eaten, uh, have you eaten Mexican food? Have, uh, have you eaten Mexican food? Have you? Have you eaten Mexican yes. food? I uh, no, ah look. no. Look, I I'm going to present. Okay, look, wait a minute. The question is uh, this one. Okay, look. Look. My name is Lee. My full name is Matthew Lee. There, there, Lee. Uh, have you eaten Mexican food? Uh, no. 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 I do. No, yes. Very good. No. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Very good. Carlita, hay Carlita una pregunta. Um, ¿Les llama la atención alguna alguna tradición uh -huh. en México? Ah, okay. Do, do, do you like any? Yes, I like as much. This is the same. The part of the Navidad is yeah. Okay. Teacher, okay. I have a question. Yes. Aya, bueno, how did you say? Si a, es pregunta, si allá también se celebra el Día de la Mujer. O sea, okay. hoy. Do the... you, you celebrate? Woman is a uh, uh, in yes, uh, this is a death day. Uh, I uh, the Kankwa dice que sí, que es un día especial. Uh, <laughs> Uh, in that day, I'm very, very happy. Uh, es un día muy, muy and, feliz. Uh, very good. Uh, uh, when my boyfriend gave me a flower, very beautiful. Ah, ese que su novio le dio en ese, en ese día un día, un arreglo floral muy bonito. Yes. Okay. Okay. Lee. Could you please ask a question for Monse? Me, me, Anne? Yes, ask a, ask okay. a question to Monse. Please. Mons, mo, Mons? Monse. Mons, Monse, Monse? Yes. Can you, uh, can you a question? Uh, can, can you? No, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Can I question, Monsa? Monsa, can I ask you a question? Así, Monsa, si puede preguntarte algo. 
Uh, yes. Um, hello. Um, how are you? De Monse. How old are I you, Monse? How old? ¿Cuántos años tengo, no? Yes. Uh -huh. okay. I am 16 years. 16? Uh, yes. 16 me. Ah, como ella, mismo. como ella dice, como ella. Ok, como ella. Oh. Ok. Uh, ok. Uh, please, Lick, please ask a question to Carla, please. Hello, hello, Carla. Can you ask me a new question? ¿Puedo hacer una pregunta, Carla? Yes. Where are you from in Mexico? ¿Que si vives en México, Carla? Yes. Ah, ya. No, ya, 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 I live in I live in Zumpango. I, I, I live in Zumpango. Okay. I live in Zumpango, I live in Yambuka. Zumpango. Zumpango. Uh, yes, Zumpango. Uh, in free time, you often. What, what are you often in free time? Uh, ¿Qué hacen en el tiempo libre, Carla? Um, watch TV. Um, exercise. Um, oh. Very good. Okay. Okay. Monse, please ask a question to Lee. Hay una pregunta a Lee, Monse. Uh, okay. Um, Monse, uh, dice where do you live? In Vietnam, o sea, ¿dónde vive en Vietnam? Ah, where do you live? In Vietnam. Ah, Lee, you... Lee, Monse um, wants to know where do you live in, in Vietnam? Um, uh, I live in Quang Binh Province. Okay. Yes, Quang Binh Province. Provincia de Quang Binh. Yes. Uh, Quang Binh Province is, is, um, Many a lot of view. Ah, it's a place that has many beautiful vistas. Okay, Carla, please ask a question. Ask a question to Ali, Carla, please. Um, eso que más gusta de Vietnam. Ajá. What? Daphne, Carla wants to know uh, what do you like the most from Vietnam? I, I like the food in my country. La comida de su país. <laughs> okay. Uh, in Vietnam, the food is uh, very disgusting. Es que es muy deliciosa la comida de la comida vietnamita. Y muy saludable, dice. Okay. Uh, um, um, teacher. Sí. Sí. Uh, how do you say cómo es Vietnam en sí. cuestión general? Ah, uh, Lee. Monse wants to know what is Vietnam like. In general, yeah. in general. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Vietnam is very, very beautiful. Muy bonito. In, uh, beautiful. I have a uh, uh, Phong Nha case. Uh, uh, <laughs> Sun Dong, Sun Dong cake. And, um, yeah. Uh, muy bonito, muy tranquilo. Un lugar pacífico, dice. Paris, but this, but 
Karate K and many, many, many uh, of you. Y muchos lugares que visitar. Okay. No. Carlita, please. Ay, Carla, una, una pregunta, Carla. Um, la ho 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 Vietnam như thế nào? No sé. Lo que quieras, Carla. Tú, tú sí que dime en español y yo lo, yo lo pongo en inglés. Okay. Um, ¿Les gustaría viajar a México o conocer México? ¿O conocer México? Okay. You like to visit Mexico? Uh, yes, I want to go to Mexico. Dice que sí, que le encantaría I, mucho visitar el país. If I have a chain, I, uh, I go, I, I want to, I want to be visit Mexico. Dice que si tiene oportunidad le gustaría visitar a México en el futuro porque sabe que es un lugar muy bonito. Hmm. Okay, uh, I know uh, my children will introduce you um, tradition of Vietnam and I, I think it's, it's uh, like in Mexico that is the altar. That is the altar, okay? Good, good. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hello everybody, my name is Dwi, I'm from Nguyen Trai High School. Today, today I introduce the author of Vietnam. Sepetition play an important role in Vietnamese life. They always believe, believe in spirit spiritual thing like the devil. Therefore, in the daily life, they have an honor to worship their ancestors as well as the decades. On the altar, they often leave food or milk to worship their ancestors so they can pay home and pay tribute to the ancestors. That, that is why for many days of the year, people not only service right on the table, but also serve, service is on the answer because the ancestor will not is with. This is one of the few cultural future of Vietnamese people. Thank you for watching. <laughs> ah, listening. <laughs> okay, we have any questions? No. <laughs> They are so shy. Uh, do you have any question about the altar in Vietnamese altar? And uh, do you uh, see uh, it is different from the altar in Mexico? Is it the same or different? Very good. Uh, pre pregunta la, ma la maestra, chicos, si el altar vietnamita es diferente o muy parecido al altar mexicano. A ver, Monse, tú, tú dime y yo... Yo te traduzco, Monse. Eh, es que no, no me quedó muy claro si es un altar religioso o altar. Ajá, exactamente, altar religioso. Yes. Ah, entonces creo que no es diferente. Yes, me estoy diciendo que el altar de Vietnamese altar es similar, similar to Mexican altar. Es also for religious purposes. Yeah. Ok, for it's good, yes. And um, uh, very uh, similar in uh, 
uh, the uh, in Vietnam, and now that is a very uh, a very popular street food of Vietnam. That is Vietnamese bread. Okay, uh, you can see some pictures. Yeah, yeah, my son get out something. Yeah. Hi everyone, my name is Cha. I'm 16 years old. Uh, I will I will speak Vietnamese bread. Uh, Vietnamese bread is a type of street food of Vietnam. The cell is a, a lot of stores with crispy skin. The stop in the car is a filling consisting of a dense layer of pate, a layer of butter, then cucumber, meat, green vegetable, and soy sauce. Yeah. And the way of making, the way of making, of making uh, that the way of making bread. The first, uh, the. Do you want to eat? Do you want to try? Do you want to eat? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that is very popular street food in Vietnam, and we eat uh, bread right, uh, in the morning, and maybe all day. Delicious. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is, uh, it's uh, like uh, fast food, and everyone can make it. It looks delicious. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Carla and Monsa, do you have any question about food in Vietnam? Carla and Monsa, do you have any question about food in Vietnam? Carla and Monsa, do you have any question about food in Vietnam? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have Mo, a question. Monse, Monse has a question. Okay. Monse? Uh, you, you bread is sweet, dulce? Sí, no, sweet. Is, is, yeah. is, is the bread sweet or salty? Ah, so we, ah, no, no, it's not sweet. No es dulce. We have two kind, yeah, we have two kind of bread. Uh, the sweet panes? one is, yeah, it's nothing inside. The, uh, the sweet one is nothing inside, and this is the popular one that it have many things inside. Yeah, okay. for example, cucumber, tomato, meat, or peat, right? And mayonnaise. <laughs> ah, es, es similar que en México, Monse. El pan dulce no tiene nada dentro, y el pan salado puede llevar todo lo que se ve ahí en, en la imagen. Okay. Yeah. Ah, they remind of yeah. Ah, okay. And now uh, one more food about in Vietnam that is a, a typical meal in Vietnam. A typical meal in Vietnam. Okay. Una comida típica en Vietnam. Okay. Hello, maker. My name is Mai. I'm 16 years old. Um, I live in Quang Binh Province. Uh, I would like to in, introduce about a uh, typical meal in Vietnam. Uh, Vietnam is new traditional in collective by three meal before fat, luck, and dinner. Um, I review the menu in menu your people Vietnam in the first rice noodle or bread, uh, the second fit meat stew egg. Uh, when you were invited by them to act, you were did, did very well, but as a reality, I am not sure that it will be like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
I don't you understand what she's to talk? <laughs> As if you try. Um, a very typical meal in Vietnam include rice. Do you um, do you have rice? Yes. Yes. Um, yes. Uh, some kind of meat, maybe chicken, maybe beef, maybe pork, and many kind of cooking of meat. Okay. And uh, many kind of um, the cheese, the cheese and fruit, yeah? and soup made from the cheese and some tofu. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. How about a typical meal in? Um, how about a typical meal in Mexico? Okay. Pre te pregunta Carlita, que ¿cuál es una comida típica en México, Carlita? Um, los tamales. Exactly. A, a typical food in, in Mexico, don Carla Cesar is tamales or tacos. Sí, yo como ni hay. Tacos. Good. Very good. Okay, don. So I think it's time for, for the class to finish. Okay. So thank you very much, don. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you for your class. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your students. Okay. Así que despídense, Monse y Carlita. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Is it your time? Thank you. No, no. By now? Are you okay? Okay, yeah. Uh, and thank you for your time and thank you for your share about us. Uh, very nice food uh, in Mexico. Uh, uh, and uh, uh, the road line is say goodbye, Amy. Uh, Okay. Well, Do you want to? You. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Yeah. Goodbye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.